spend way, way, pretty much every weekend on the road. And so we want to hear a wonderful tale of travel, either in the FCA or in the <coughs> world. So, so which we would like to begin this tale of travel? A long time ago, in the 13th century, before the Mafia existed, <laughs> there was a young woman fair of heart and fair of spirit. But alas, she was not fair of face. Oh, dear. Why do you look at me? <laughs> Even now, bring surprise. I think it is time for me to find fortune on the road. So she packed her meager belongings and set off to find her fortune on the road. As she was traveling through town and countryside, she noticed that uh, most of the people didn't want to talk to her. She would move into an inn and everyone would move right out the front door. Sit down at the table, the only would bring her ale. It was a very, very sad time for the poor lady. Try as she might, she just could not find anyone who would help her have an adventure on the road. And if one is going to have a life on the road, one needs adventures. <laughs> and so as she traveled down the road, she heard a hammer ringing, and there was a blacksmith working at his forge and hammering, and she said, Blacksmith, look at my visage. I need something. Make me a beautiful iron mask. Or the vestry, 
When the children were unable to find the priest, they set to looking for a jewel themselves. And lo, upon a large upon a large pedestal, there was a beautiful chalice with the perfect jewel. Now the children have to be jewel these to retain it. But they proceeded with alacrity and cried it free with the daggers that they had with having food. <laughs> Now that they had the precious stone, they happily went back to the blacksmith and said, Here, now you can finish the mask for our friend the horse. And they were very proud of themselves. And the blacksmith was also very proud of his work. He was able to complete the mask, which he then put on the horse. And the horse was indeed beautiful. In fact, as he put the mask on the horse, angels were known to sing. Oh. and had done so. <laughs> 